Welcome back to the Morning Wrap. Our next guest has penned songs for country artists like Tim McGraw, Dolly Parton, Cody Johnson. But now he's released his own EP, Meet Ryan Larkins, and he's joining me right here. This is Ryan. Hi. Hey, how are you doing? <laughs> good morning. How are you? Good morning. It's so good to be here. Um, I just heard your mic check. You sound phenomenal. Oh, thank you so much. And we're going to get you to play a little something in just a little bit. But what does it feel like to finally have your EP out? It is so amazing. You know, I've written songs for such a long time, you know, for for other people and now just being able to sing some of my favorite songs it's just it's incredible i'm loving it what was that journey like for you because i know a lot of people who are singer songwriters who are writing or producing content for other people try to do that crossover and sometimes it's just a really difficult thing to do so what was it like for you and how do you feel about this moving forward you also have a show tonight too that's right got a show tonight but um it's kind of, it's interesting, like mm -hmm. every time I go in to write a song, even before I was an artist, I would go into the room and write songs for me, you mm -hmm. know, songs that I love, they were my story, and you know, people just heard those songs and said, hey, these are songs that I could hear myself singing, and then that's how I got songs recorded by other people, and uh, so it's just a natural thing, you know, to sing my songs, because it, I'm They're just yours. basically <laughs> telling my story, you yeah. know, so it's great. Where do you get a lot of your inspiration from? I really get a lot of my inspiration from family, from my wife. We've been married for 15 years, Aww. and uh, my kids. You know, they're they're so fun, and uh, just just life. You know, that's where I get my ideas, and I like to go for walks in the morning and just see what's out there, and and I try to get an idea every day and start working on it. What do the kids think about your life? Do they look at the screen, being like, "Oh my gosh, that's my dad"? They're starting to. It's so <laughs> funny. Like they'll come home from school and they'll be like, "Oh, so and so was talking about you. You, they heard you on the radio." or you know they looked you up on on Spotify and it, I mean it's just cool it, it's so much fun and and we're having a time it's are they so tapping fun. around grabbing the guitar are they they are yeah. they are it, you should you should check out my Instagram and my social media they're all over it and we <laughs> we record songs together Aww, and it's just fun we're cute. having a blast I love this okay so tell me about the troubadour tonight because I know I've been there it's a phenomenal venue I think you're gonna have a blast but this is your first time performing at the troubadour it is I am so excited and this is the second Second night of this tour, this Hey Jack tour with Priscilla Block, and I am so excited. It's going to be a blast, a lot of energy, mm -hmm. and, you know, telling a few stories, and it's just going to be a great time. I hope everybody can come out. How long is your set? My set is 40 minutes, so it's going to be a, be a little, little bit of a of time. Okay. You know? <laughs> yeah, that is going to be a great time. Also, it's a Thursday, so everyone gets in that weekend mode. That's so right. You get an even better crowd that comes out, in my opinion, of course. Um, I want to talk about all the streams that you have. So you wrote a song for Cody Johnson, The Painter. I did. Uh, lots of streams, talking millions of streams. That's How did you feel about that? It, it's amazing. Yeah. Like, I just, I can't believe it, you know, and hearing him sing a song and it's on the radio, you know, mm -hmm. that's the coolest thing to be driving down the road with my family and that song comes on and, you know, that's about my wife. So it's, it's really special. You're going to get millions of streams yourself with your own it. songs, with your own EP and your own songs. We're going to hear you play right now. Yes. Um, tell me what you're going to play for us. I'm going to play King of Country Music, and this is my current single at Country Radio. I'm so excited about this song. And tell me a little bit about the song. Yeah, so I was driving around Nashville one day listening to classic country music, which is my favorite, and uh, listening to George Strait, Dolly Parton, Willie Nelson, and my oldest son, he asked me, he was like, Dad, who is the greatest country singer of all time? Who's the king of country music? Mm -hmm. And uh, I thought about it, and he kind of stumped me. I didn't know what to say. And at a red light on Charlotte Avenue, it hit me. Like, I know exactly who the king of country music is. And so I wrote this song about it. Look at this. Okay, yeah. so it's performance time. Take it away. All right. You can hear him in the church house on Sunday morning. They still play it on the radio You can hear his voice from Saginaw to Houston It echoes down the halls on Music Row And some say John, some say Travis Some say Straight, some say Haggard Are sitting on the throne all oh, that's well and good Don't get me wrong But the king of country music Is the song Speak 
speaking for the nine to fivers in the trenches. Makes him feel like he's right there with them too. Take it us, take us away. Keep going. It ain't the steel, <laughs> it ain't the fiddle, it ain't that right in the middle. 